Hey, it's Clay Trader, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol MYSZ. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. Real quick, what do I mean by 30 minute in case maybe you're new to charts? Instead of each one of these candlesticks here representing one day's worth of price action, which is what you would normally see, each one represents 30 minutes. So all this here may look like several days worth of time. It's actually just today's price action broken down into 30 minute time slices. I like to this time frame. I think it does a good job of telling the quote unquote story of the price. And in this situation it makes summarizing uh, the price action quite straightforward. So if you were to say, Clay, look, just summarize the price action for me. What would you say? You know, this was a pump and dump on thin ice. Now, before you start throwing stones at me, when I say pumping up, I'm not implying that this company is being run out of somebody's attic over in North Korea. I'm just making that statement based solely on how the price acted today. And my definition of a pump and dump is a price makes a really nice move, and then within a relatively short amount of time, the price goes right back to where it all started, or in some cases, even lower. So let's just first start by mapping out, you know, kind of where did all this start? And in my mind, it all started when it broke out of the range that it had been trapped in. And that range was right here. Give or take, we'll call it right down here at about a dollar and twenty. You can see that going into uh, today, many times the price, you know, tried to get up above dollar twenty, failed, failed. So that was definitely what was keeping it down. So the price broke above it, and that is where I would, you know, define the starting point. So let's go through the definition. Price makes a really nice move. Well, considering that the price not only, you know, made a nice move. Uh, you know, right out of the get go with the gap up, but even after the gap up, price came all the way up there. So yeah. First part of the definition, price made a nice move, no doubt about it. And then the price within a relatively short amount of time, and considering this all happened in the same day, I would say, yeah, that's a pretty short amount of time. Price goes right back to where it started or lower. And that's where the thin ice comes into play because yeah, the price had a huge old pullback, but to be fair, to be fair, the price didn't quite go to where it started or lower. So that's where the thin ice comes into play. How am I defining thin ice? Well, right there at $1.20 for the simple reason that in the event the price does break through the thin ice and goes down through $1.20, at that point in time, that would literally be putting the price right back into this area, right back into the range where everything started from. And again, I'm assuming I state the obvious when I say that's not really what a genuinely powerful move does. A genuinely powerful move is gonna make progress forward. It's not gonna go back to where it was. So to give, like I said, credit to the bulls, they'll still cut them some slack. They do still have an opportunity because technically speaking, uh, you know, the price could you know, pull one of these numbers where it bounces around here and then heads back up. And then from the grand scheme of things perspective, if you look at these as stair steps, well then yeah, you'd have a set of lows there, you'd have that set right there, and you would have stair steps going in the upwards direction. So there is a still a chance for the bulls, but they are definitely walking on thin ice. So we'll see uh, how they handle the next couple of days of the week. One of the biggest questions that I get is, hey Clay, how do you find the stocks that you trade? So what I've done is put together a free resource guide where I talk about the tools that I use to locate stocks that I find interesting and think may have potential. So if that sounds like something that could add value to you as a trader, then click on the image that is up on the screen right now and I will email you the guide. The guide itself is very short and to the point and best part, it's completely free. Thanks for watching the video. Let me know if you have any questions.